everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Satoshi Sean. Glad that you're here. Uh, if it's your first time here, please hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications. Try to get a review or two out uh, a week, as well as the uh, crypto lunch break, which we do every uh, day at 12 o'clock uh, Central Time, Central U.S. Time. Um, uh, me and my buddy over at Kiss Crypto, his link is right over here. Um, for him, it's crypto tea time because it's like eight at night or or seven at night over there where he is in Europa. Um, also, no matter what, if you're an old subscriber, new subscriber, please crush the like button. Really, really helps me out with YouTube's algorithm. Today, I'm going to do a review of something that actually uh, Lee over at Kiss had talked to me about uh, that he thought I would be very into, which I am. Uh, if you follow my channel or know me for years, I've uh, there's certain I've always said there's certain industries that blockchain is just tailor-made for, just perfect for, um, to solve the some of the big problems that that have been uh, plaguing those industries, like like supply chain, um, voting, land ownership, which that actually land ownership falls under what I'm going to go over. One of the big things I think is data storage. Data storage needs to be secure. Um, encrypted so that nobody can even if someone is able to see something on it they can't they can't uh, uh actually see it they can just kind of see the the box not what's in it um so i actually mined uh sidecoin back in the day because i i was really really thought that this is a perfect like i said a perfect perfect industry um to be disrupted and right now it's very obvious uh the big data storage providers just don't really care about your security, your privacy, um, or in some cases, they're just actually out to make money on it. Uh, even if they're not completely nefarious and trying to make money on it, still the security is not as, as good as it should be. There's constant breaches, constant hacks, people getting, you know, things leaked. Um, so it is very, it's something that really, really needs to be, uh, to be looked at and there is definite issue. So that brings us to Internext. Um, now, Internex is not a new kid on the blockchain, as everyone everyone says. They've been around for a while, years. Uh, they have made it through the bear market. They have uh, survived. They've been working on their tech, um, and they have a working product. So these are things that I'm really, really excited about, which uh, me and Kiss have been looking at the past few months. Uh, projects that really kind of came through the hype of the last bull run, they are still around. They survived uh, through the through the the crypto winter and the bear market. They've been working on their tech, and now they're all those things are kind of coming to fruition now. So, Internex is something that we took a look at, uh, and like I said, they have a working product. It looks very very solid. I like what I see um, for a host of reasons. I'm going to do kind of an in depth. Uh, dive into this to cover everything from tokenomics to or from the token to more technical like setting it up and then the actual product that they sell um so right now i have i think it's with through microsoft uh like i think i pay like a dollar a month for a gig um with internex you can get two gigs for free sign up right now click here start for free all over the website you can click start different places um download the app and it's clean it's nice looking uh, you can also download the desktop and you can get started with two gigabytes now that's not for like a month and then you start getting charged it's two gigs for free uh for life then they have their premium plans which you still can upgrade to that free for a month um these are some people that are already using it so let us get into it first off i'll go over some of the basics the you know the spiel uh internex is uh, set up to enrich life through revolutionary technology blockchain um the goal is to create a vast range of innovative mass market services that disrupt various technology industries they're not just looking at storage they're also looking at uh developing like a decentralized internet uh, they have a, a special picture uh, thing coming um now we believe uh, that technology should empower the individual and not make them powerless to the corporation. 
The intention is to offer technology that doesn't undermine the privacy of the individual. So when you read that, um, I don't know about you, the first thing I think is it's not really business oriented. It really is. In fact, they actually have a lot of things set up for businesses. But even if they have a business solution, it doesn't, you don't have to give up privacy as the individual for using it. Um, really, really is awesome, uh, which I'll, I'll go into why. They've got the team right here on the site. Uh, news articles, they're on a few exchanges right now. Um, <clears throat> say right, you can start, get started for free. These links are all over the site. Um, it is free for the two. 20 gigs is a uh, 0.89, so less than one uh, C with lines in it. Uh, 200 gigs, which is huge. It's only 350, uh, these uh, Cs with lines in them. And two terabytes is less than 10 euros fine it's not an e it doesn't look like any e. it looks like a c with lines in it and why is there two lines there's not one line so it doesn't look like any e. anyway um you can see the app documents all that stuff you can you can set up different uh different folders different colors it is it looks nice um and you can get updates by signing up for the email so the Internext Drive, this is the product that you would sign up for, you would get. Um, it is a cloud storage, which you can get two gigs free for life. Once again, click there to start, click there to download the desktop. Um, now, here's the more technical side of it. So, a zero-knowledge file storage service that's based on absolute privacy and uncompromised security. Internext Drive is designed from the inside out, okay. So, it is a cloud storage that you can store your digital possessions or files. Now, it's encrypted from a client entity from your end when you put it on. So files are end-to-end -end encrypted and then fragmented. What that means is once they're encrypted, they're broken up. So it's not the, the, the files are not together anymore. Then it's distributed to uh, all these different nodes and machines. So now your, all your information or your entire file is not in one place. Kind of like... Uh, Bit shares used to be. It, you would uh, you weren't sharing an entire file. You were sharing bits of it. So these this is broken up and fragmented after it's encrypted. So it's very very secure. Uh, to different machines around the world, your personal data is part of our distributed network and no longer sitting in one centralized location. Uh, so here once again, you can get started free forever. There's a link. Um, this one's uh, about a uh, a euro for 20 because so that is a good deal 20 gigs for for a buck i'm paying a buck i think for for one um this is just a cool thing for every year uh that you're subscribed they plant a tree all right um you can see here the app like i said very nice it's very customizable too which you know that's a nice point to make but it works and it's cool um, so the files are uploaded on the client side, encrypted, fragmented into independent shards. The machines hold encrypted shards, never the whole file. Uh, the servers are distributed all over the earth. Um, in answer to the challenge of providing a truly secure and private cloud storage solution, which like I said right now, there really isn't anything out there that's really uh, focuses on your private privacy and anonymity um, and your the security level that this offers, that blockchain offers, that encryption offers. I mean, governments have that kind of stuff, but not, you know, people. So no third party can ever access your files. Now you hold your private key or the, the decryption key to retrieve the different fragments, put them together and then decrypt them. And then beautiful interface. You can, you know, it's, it's nice, it's pretty uh, and easily customizable. Okay. Customize your folders. I'm going to leave links to the website. Um, once again, two free everywhere. Uh, and then here, uh, secure teams to help with uh, more business solutions like I was talking about. All right. Another cool thing, Internex tokens. You can buy the Internex tokens um, right on the site. They're on Mercatox, uh, Uniswap, I think, and some other ones. But look at here, you can just uh, 
put in what you want to put. Like I'm going to put a five Ethereum and what I would get or Litecoin. And then it gives you a calculator right here. You put in your address, done. Here we go. You have at Mercantile Uniswap. There they are there. Okay. And then your Coinbase wallet. So a lot of wallets for you to choose from. Um, there's also a, okay, here, we'll go up over this. So the internet's, internet's core is not the product side of it. It's more the, uh, the technical side of it on the, on the other side, the, uh, the node network and all that. Um, you can download it here onto your computer. They have over a hundred nodes running right now in different countries. It is a simple peer to peer downloadable application that enables hosts, which is your, your computer or your system to act as computing servers securely store and share encrypted shards so you don't have the whole file of internet drivers which is what the drive is the product uh, users data and they have <laughs> they have more than one pb more than one peanut butter available data i don't even know what a pb is i don't know what's after terabyte it's the whatever that's that may be like something after that but it's a it's a peanut butter so uh you download it and run it, and then you would uh, choose how you choose how much of your uh, free storage space you allocate to them to run the background. The more that you that the more that you give up, the more you get paid because it's like you're you're running out you're renting out your storage to the network, so you do get rewarded in your next token. Um, then they have a uh, a multiplier so if you're staking their coins the more you stake the bigger the multiplier the more money you get paid every month and the more uh, kind of bumps you in line further up for your computer to be used for storage okay uh, hosts ran out the, oh, I guess I could have just read it instead of explaining it hosts run out their computers extra hard drive space which allows the strong strong it's late allows the storing and uploading of users encrypted data the shards um, in return hosts will be paid in our cryptocurrency intx the more hard drive space you allocate to the network the more intx you will earn there actually is a uh, like a calculator on the site for you to use but to get that you need to use the core link in the bottom not the one up top um, each host can decide how much computer resources to designate to the network as well as when and for how long so it's very you're very much in control of uh of what you're letting them do um you can leave internet core running in the background your computer will earn you a passive income better by design you're not really gonna get rich doing this but when you really take a step back like i said i'm paying for my little bit of storage um that is not very secure that i am a little leery about um Whereas here you can get two gigs free and actually get paid by the storage company. It's the complete opposite. Um, so here's the calculator. So let's say I got a new computer that I'm just about to, uh, to get set up. I think I have three terabytes. So if I was to allocate one terabyte and I was to hold 2,000 uh, INXT tokens, I'd be getting about 30 euros a month. So that's like, I don't know, 35 bucks. So instead of paying a dollar a month for one gig, I get two gigs free and I get paid 35 bucks just to, uh, for nothing, basically for letting them use my unused storage. Pretty cool. Uh, here's the dashboard and then, uh, how to set up setting up just a uh, enter your c20 address but it's very very simple like i said it looks easy and here you go here's the app let me see down here at the bottom you see where it says core that's where you got to click to get to the calculator if not it uh it brings you to a different page that doesn't have the calculator brings you to this page which doesn't have the calculator but you can download the core desktop app right here if you do that and then walks you through how to set it up there are uh, directions it, now the, the payments are paid out 
Can anyone run Interact? So totally anybody. Operating system is Linux, Windows, and Mac. Minimum amount of space you need to get paid, 500, I think. 500 gigs to host. And how much data can you expect your node to store? Where is it? How often will I get paid? I think it's once a month. Internet, Internet core payouts are usually sent during the first week of each new month. So that is about it for Internext. I'll put links to the site. If you have any questions, uh, hit me in the comments below, but head over to their Telegram. Um, I'll put a link, there's their Twitter. I'll put a link to their uh, their social media outlets into the uh, description as well. That is about it, Internet, check it out. Um, also their token is looking like, uh, I mean, Kiff did a review on that. He hit the the, the investment side of it, or the, a little bit a uh, little bit more than I did. Me going into the tech and what the actual product is, and the tech of setting up the the node. He did a little bit more on the tokens and the money side of it. So you can check that out as well. I'll put a link in his in the description too. Um, that's it. I'm Satoshi Sean. It was good hanging out with you. You guys take care. I'll see you in the next video.